Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In today's video I'm going to Cartier, I'm going to try on a few things and I'm also going to choose a gift for my husband for his birthday and I'm gonna take you with me. I hope that you like this video and will find it interesting. By the way guys, if you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section down below. If you like my content, please give it a thumbs up, I would really appreciate it. Subscribe to my channel and follow me on my Instagram account, which is the same as my YouTube account, black and gold style. Actually, my husband is not into jewelry. He only wears a watch, but I think there is one thing that he might like and I'm gonna get it for him for his birthday. Since I'm here, I'm also going to try on some of the items that I like. I want to compare them and show them to you as well. This watch is so pretty. I have never seen it, but it's so stunning. The color of the gold is just so beautiful. I just love this combination. It's so gorgeous. I wanted to try on Clash de Cartier earrings in both sizes. They are so beautiful and I would like to have something else from this collection to match my ring. Initially I wanted to get a bracelet, but I'm worried that it will keep scratching my Cartier Love bracelet. So a pair of earrings would be quite good. I just love the design, the spikes. It has such a stunning and edgy look. However, I feel like the big earrings are a little bit too big for me. I just wish they were a bit smaller. And also they are a little bit heavy, they are sagging my earlobes. But the design on its own is just so beautiful. I will also try them on in a smaller size and compare them again. I previously tried on both of the sizes in some of my videos, but I wanted to see them again and see how they look on me now. I feel like I love Cartier so much and their customer service is incredible. And I just want to add something because I just love the brand. But I'm really not sure about this ones. I'm actually a huge fan of earrings, I wear them the most and they match with so many of my outfits. I typically go for earrings first and then I start creating sets, either get a bracelet or a ring or a necklace. They look like a beautiful set with the ring. I'm so obsessed with this ring, it's probably my most favorite. And by the way guys, I have recently posted the unboxing of this one and I'll link it down for you guys in case you want to check it out. It was part of my birthday slash Christmas gift. Previously, I also posted a detailed review video of this ring and I will add it as well. Actually, the price has gone up on this one since I saw them last time and many other items have gone up in price. Hopefully we will not have another price increase this year, fingers crossed. And here is the smaller size. They do look better, but I actually wish that there was a size in between, not too big and not too small. And also last time when I tried them on, they only had one pair and it was also reserved. But now they have so many items. The stock is excellent, just like before the pandemic, which is amazing. Besides, there are so many tourists in Singapore. The demand has gone up by a lot. So having a good stock is important. But I have to say this size is not too bad. I'm going to think about this. They could be a good everyday alternative. I think they would be even appropriate to wear to work. And they make a really nice set with my Clash de Cartier ring. Beautiful earrings. There is also another pair with diamonds, but I feel like the ones that I'm trying on are actually better. Clash de Cartier is the design that I prefer without the diamonds because I feel like it's already quite busy looking and the gold is just so beautiful. 
it's not as pink as typical pink gold it's actually my favorite shade i got my husband's gift we are going to pack it now and i'm going to add the stamps to the package i never had my cartier jewelry wrapped like that i believe they only do that for online purchases I think this packaging is just so unique and so special and no other brand wraps it like that. I'm going to stamp it myself from both sides. This is so cool, I love it. I'm so glad that Cartier has these services now. This is so amazing. I think it's quite new because I didn't see it previously. So we're just gonna stamp it, let it dry a bit and do the other side as well. And the stamps have the logo which is so nice. I love Cartier for this kind of details. This is so special. I also love Cartier because of their after sales customer service, it's incredible. Especially after they upgraded the screws in my Cartier Love bracelet and I spoke about it in my previous vlog which I'll link for you guys in case you want to check it out. That's why I love the brand. It's not just the experience but it's also aftercare service. It's one of the most amazing. I love it so much. I'm going to show you what I got for my husband as well. I got him this Cartier Love ring in a standard size from the Cartier Love collection, which is so beautiful. It's my favorite. I started my Cartier journey with this collection and my first purchase was Cartier Love necklace. And afterwards I got my bracelet and then I moved on to other collections. By the way guys, I will link down my full jewelry collection video for you guys in case you want to have a look. Back to the ring. It is in a size 57 in white gold and in a standard size. Actually at the beginning we could not decide about the metal. This ring comes in white gold and in platinum as well. You can see them both side by side. On the right hand side the ring is in white gold and on the left hand side it is in platinum. Actually you can't really see a big difference and by the way they are both in the same size. I don't know why the platinum looks a little bit bigger but the thickness is the same. Maybe it's because I'm holding my hand like that. I actually prefer platinum, but the only reason why I didn't get it is because the sales associate told me that it won't be easy to polish it and also the size was not available so I would have to pre-order it and wait for a while. But the fact that it wouldn't be easy to polish it put me off it so I decided to go for white gold. Also the white gold is meant to be sturdier than platinum so it's not going to be as easy to see the scratches but the only thing is the white gold might change its color after a while i have a friend who has a bracelet for many years it still looks okay i think a lot depends on how you look after it if you don't scratch it a lot i think it's gonna look all right anyway we will have to wait and see i hope that my husband is going to like it Anyways guys, this is it. I hope that you enjoyed this video and found it interesting. Please consider giving this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and follow me on my Instagram account which is the same as my YouTube account, black and gold style. Have a great day and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!